Hey guys, welcome to practice. Thank you so much for being here today. Hi, good to see you. Good to see you. Happy New Year. If I haven't seen you yet in person, I'm sending you so much love. So much love. Um, I hope uh, you're having a beautiful start to the year. And um, I just wanted to take you through a little... Um, practice this evening to help you unwind and just um, kind of, you know, uh, disconnect from your day a little bit. Uh, so we're just going to do some seated movement practice. We're going to do a little bit of breath work and then we'll come into really, really simple meditation, um, meditation kind of mindfulness uh, technique kind of work. All right. So um, make sure that you're uh, in a comfortable place. Uh, that you're sitting down comfortably and uh, when it comes time to meditate or close your eyes feel free to take yourself up against a wall if you need the wall space feel free to lay down but try not to fall asleep if that's okay and um, just enjoy yourself so um, you know the practice basically allows us to just get back into the body and reconnect with our breathing and use the power of everything that is inside of us to help us come back to a place of centeredness and grounding. All right, so uh, we'll give it maybe another 30 seconds and we'll get, go ahead and get started. In the meantime, if you like to sit on a cushion, find yourself a cushion. If you'd like to sit on, um, you know, a, on a chair, that's fine too. Whatever seated position suits you best is absolutely fine by me. So go ahead and find yourself a seat and we'll go ahead and get started. So once you sat down, just go ahead and close your eyes and start to just come into your body. So start to slow the breathing down. See if you can just send your breath into all four corners of your rib cage of your lungs just start, start to think about expanding all the way around i think you know when our when we lead busy lives we tend to get very very contracted too much is going on too much to think about too many people to contact too many meetings and we're all just running around so take a moment to just settle into your breath and notice how that feels welcome guys welcome welcome so we're just coming into um, just setting ourselves up for the next 30 minutes. So just go ahead and find yourself a seat and we'll go ahead and get started. So just gently just start to think about moving your shoulders a little bit. The movements can be big, they can be small, whatever keeps you going, whatever feels like a good idea for today. Sometimes we're energetic and we've got lots um, that we can put out there. Some days are just about getting through. So just notice where you are today, how much you've been carrying on your shoulders today. And just give yourself permission with every exhalation to just release whatever it is that you've been carrying, all that baggage that you set down on your tra upper traps or on your shoulders. Just give yourself permission to release it. You've been going one way, go ahead and go the opposite way. Just allow yourself to go the opposite way. Make the circles as big or small as you like. There's no wrong or right way to move. Just allow yourself to breathe, perhaps synchronizing breath and movement. Inhale to bring the shoulders up around the ears. Exhale to release. You're gonna take your right hand over to the left side of your head. Gently guide the head over to the right side. You can take your left hand out to the left. Gently reach the arm away from you. You can walk the fingertips along the floor. Just gently reach away from you. Breathe into the side of the neck. Again, the neck tends to be where we hold a lot of our tension. Just give yourself permission to release whatever it is that you're holding in this space.
coming back through center let's go the other side so left hand to the side of the uh, right side of your head gently guide the head over to the left side allow yourself to just stretch the right arm across the floor breathe into any tightness so this was my experiment with my own practice yesterday it is absolutely possible to send your expansive inhale into any part of the body that feels a little bit contracted a little bit small a little bit restricted just breathe into that place close your eyes and send your breath there inhaling to come back through center we're quickly just going to do some head circles so I want you to take these nice and slow almost as an experiment so with your eyes closed we're just going to start to create circles with the head if you find a spot that feels a little bit sticky just take a moment in that in that place just to wiggle around a little bit and just notice if you can just kind of work through whatever it is that you're feeling so nice big slow circles all the way around you might find some spots that connect all the way into your upper back for me that's always the case so i just like to stay in those places just stay in that place for a little bit longer just notice if you can just stretch that part out a little bit more wiggle around a little bit breathe into your upper back a little bit give me two more in the direction that you are currently going in Again, no right or wrong way to do this. Just allow yourself to breathe. And move. And then once you get to the bottom of this next one, go ahead and switch directions. Put the chin to the chest. Think about really pressing the chin against the chest to get this really nice release in the middle back. back through center so it's a good thing you're sitting in your homes and uh, the next exercise can be a little bit intimidating in in, uh, in a public setting so we're gonna do what's called a lion's breath now lion's breathing is excellent to release any tension in the face so that you can smile bigger and broader by the end of the session all right so it looks and sounds a little bit like this you take an inhale lift your head up all the way as you exhale, you stick your tongue out. We're going to do that three more times. Inhale to lift the head all the way up. Send your chin up to the sky. As you exhale, stick your tongue out. Two more, just like that. Inhale to lift the chin up to the sky. Breathe into the body. Exhale, let it go. Last one. Inhale to breathe. Lift the chin to the sky. Deep breath in, deep breath out. As you exhale, let it go. Awesome job. Inhale to come back through center. We're just going to take slightly bigger movements. So I'm going to move away from the screen a little bit so you can see me here. You're going to cactus your arms, open the chest. Take your arms nice and wide here. So shoulders in line with elbows, elbows in line with the wrists. You're going to take an inhale here. We're going to start to cat and cow here. So inhale in this position, roll the shoulders back, lift the chest up. As you exhale, you're going to round your back, bring your elbows, forearms and palms together. So it looks a little bit like this from the side. You're going to take, take an inhale to roll the shoulders back, lift the chest up. Exhale to bring the elbows, forearms, and palms together. Let's do that a couple more times. Inhale to roll the shoulders back, lift the chest up, open, breathe. 
breathe into the front of the body as you exhale round the back breathe into the upper back that's where we tend to hold our tension let's go once more inhale roll the shoulders back lift the chest up as you exhale this time the right arm comes underneath the left arm wrap and twist the arms lift your elbows up in line with your shoulders Take an inhale, lift the arms up to the sky, roll the shoulders back, breathe into any tightness. As you exhale, round the back, try and bring your elbows to your belly button, breathe in, breathe out. Inhale to come back through center, you're gonna unravel the arms. Cactus the arms and open that chest. Exhale to round the, round the upper back. Bring the elbows, forearms, and palms together. Let's go again. Inhale, roll the shoulders back. Lift the chest up to the sky. Drop the neck and head back if that feels right. Exhale, round the back. Draw the navel in. Breathe into your upper back here. One more time. Inhale to roll the shoulders back. Lift the chest up. This time as you come forward, you're gonna take your left arm underneath the right arm. Wrap and twist. Lift the elbows up in line with your shoulders. Breathe into your body. On the inhale, drop the neck and head back if that feels right. On the exhalation, elbows to the belly button. Stretch the upper back out, the middle back out. Breathe into your spine here. Inhale to come back through center. You're gonna unravel the arms, reach the, reach the hands back behind you, wherever you are, if you have the space to place your hands back. Roll the shoulders back and lift the chest up. So we sit at desks all day long, we kind of ride in cars and we're looking at our phones, kind of probably not thinking too much about our posture. So here's a practice of just opening up the shoulders, allowing the shoulders to go back, sitting on the back rather than sitting on our chest, right? Inhale to come back through center. So go ahead and close your eyes and let's get into some breathing here. I want you to start to take deeper inhales and deeper exhales as you start to come into that comfortable seat. Roll the shoulders back. You're breathing into the front, the back, and two sides. So you got, you got a three-dimensional being. You want to breathe three-dimensionally as well. So start to think about expanding all the way around on the inhale and then contracting all the way around on the exhale. So like a balloon, all the way around on the inhale and then exhale to contract. So think about if you never thought about breathing into your upper back, really send your breath into that place. That's actually where your alveoli are. You know, the, the oxygen exchange that happens in the blood from the lungs into the bloodstream all happens in the back of the heart. So really think about breathing into that space. Mm. With your next exhalation, draw the navel in towards your spine. Think about emptying out completely. Just draw the belly in, empty out your body. No air in the lungs or the belly. And then together, let's inhale for one, two, three. Exhale for three, two, one. Again, inhale for one, two, three. Exhale for three, two, one. Inhale for one, two, three. Exhale for three, two, one. We're gonna to start to take it a little bit higher. Inhale for one, two, three, four. Exhale for four, three, two, one. Again, inhale for one, two, three, four. Exhale for four, three, two, one. We're going for five, inhale, keep inhaling, deep breath in, fill up the lungs, fill up the belly on five. Exhale for five, four, three, 
two, and one. One more time, inhale for one, two, three, four, five. Exhale for five, four, three, two, one. Next time you inhale, take a big breath in, fill up the lungs, fill up the belly, and we're holding the breath at the top. And then with an exhalation, side out, ha, let it go. Just want you to relax your shoulders completely. Feel your sit bones grounding a little bit more. So oftentimes, again, when we're trying to breathe with intention, we tend to kind of hold tension in places. So try and relax your body completely. With every single exhalation, we'll do two more of these. With every exhalation, ground your sit bones a little bit more. Get comfortable in your seats a little bit more. Let's do that one more time. Inhale. Fill up the belly, fill up the lungs. Open the mouth, exhale. Ah, let it go. If sitting up straight is not your thing, a little bit of a rounding in the back is totally fine. So, you know, my teachers, they always say you want to try and release as much tension from your body before you sit down to become really mindful. So part of becoming mindful is realizing where it is that you hold your tension and just giving yourself permission to release. Let's do that one more time. Big breath in. Open the mouth, side out. Ha. Great job. So last thing we're gonna do before we sit down to um, become a little bit mindful here is a variation of Anulom Vilom or alternate nostril breathing. So I want you to take your right hand, you're gonna take your index finger and middle finger, wrap them into your palm, then you're gonna be left with your thumb, which is gently going to um, kind of control your right nostril, and then your ring finger and your pinky will gently, mani gently manipulate your left nostril. All right, so take a few deep breaths in, a few deep breaths out, this is the mudra we're working with. And then from here, take a big breath in, big breath out. We'll gently close the right nostril, breathe in through the left for one, two, three. Close the left and exhale through the right for three, two, one. Close the right nostril, breathe in through the left for one, two, three. Close the left and exhale through the right for three, two, one. Inhale through the left for three counts. Close the left and exhale through the right for three counts. Steady stream of air through the nose. Two more rounds like this, inhaling through the left for three. And then exhaling through the right for three. So try and even out your inhale and your exhalation. Last one like this, inhale through the left. Exhale through the right. So we'll switch it around for five rounds. Inhale through the right. Two, three. Exhale through the left now. Two, three. Again, close the left. Inhale right side. Two, three. Exhale through the left two, three. Inhale, right side, nice, calm, steady breath into the body. Close the right, exhale through the left. Two more like this, inhale through the right side. Exhale through the left. Two. 
One more, inhaling through the right. Exhaling through the left. Go ahead and release your right hand down. So depending on how you feel comfortable to sit, you can turn your palms over and place them on your knees. That tends to be a good resting place. If you want to turn your palms over and place them on your knees, that's also good. If you're a little bit confused, you can go one down, one up. <laughs> that generally works too. So find a comfortable position for yourself to sit in. If you want to go ahead and sit against the wall, you can do that. If you want to go ahead and lay down, you can do that. Whatever feels right for you, please find your position. So what I would love for you to do for the next eight or so minutes is to commit yourself to your seat or your or your position all right so try to commit to being still even if there's an itch that you really 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 need to scratch think about just observing the itch like an experiment see what happens if you don't scratch the itch all right so try and be absolutely still so find a comfortable seat commit and then we're just gonna take 20 deep breaths. So like we were doing the count for three, I want you to take that count and multiply it by 20. So we're gonna do 20 breaths like this. So you're gonna inhale for three counts, nice deep inhale, and then exhale for three counts. So as soon as you start to observe the breath, what tends to happen sometimes is we try and manipulate it, we try and hold it and all that kind of stuff. So resist the urge to manipulate your breathing. In fact, if you just can, soft focus on the inhale as it travels into the body, soft focus on the exhalation as it leaves your body. On the exhalation, think about releasing, continuing to release any tension, let your seat get heavier, let your sit bones get heavier, let your pelvis just lean against the floor, let your whole body just lean against the floor. So drop everything that you are feeling, thinking, doing, making lists about, and just keep things nice and simple. Just 20 breaths, okay? You got this. So let's just close the eyes. Start to get really curious about the breath. Some of us tend to notice the breathing at the nose tip. Some of us tend to notice the breath in the chest. Some of us notice it in the belly. So take a moment to notice where it is that you actually feel the breath and bring your awareness there. So again, the first thing you might notice as you begin to breathe here is that perhaps the state of your mind is coming to the forefront. Are you feeling a little bit busy in your mind? Is your mind feeling relaxed? And also if your mind begins to run away with the breathing, try not to berate your mind. It's doing the best that it can. Just try to gently bring it back reset on the breathing. So let's start our 20 breaths now. So a couple of focusing techniques for you, for your breathing, is to watch the inhale and watch the exhale. Another way to kind of refocus yourself might be perhaps to count the breath. So one inhale, one exhale. Two, inhale, two, exhale, so on and so forth. I sometimes like to chant, oh, hum. So, oh, on the inhale, just gently in my mind, 
and hum on the exhale. It's a gentle chant, might work for you. as well that there is no wrong or right way to do this. That you just have to give yourself time and just work on cultivating this practice. Simple, simple practice. Perhaps as you watch your breathing as well, you start to notice how marvelous and how essential this thing that we do all day long, that we take for granted, that we just knew how to do ever since we've been alive. We start to pay attention and focus our awareness on the breath. There are so many other things about ourselves that actually begin to come to light. stop to focus on the breathing, you may perhaps notice for the first time today how we are actually doing, not how we're supposed to be doing, not how everyone expects us to be doing, but how we are really, really feeling. However you are feeling is absolutely valid it is ridiculous to think that we are fine all the time and if you are tired it's okay to be tired if you are overwhelmed it's okay to be overwhelmed If you're in peace, and that's beautiful too. Take five more breaths. Travel into your body with your inhalation. Let the inhale carry with it a sense of love and gratitude for everything that your body does without you even asking. 
Let the exhales carry away any tension, any stress that the day may have brought on. Let's take three big breaths together, keeping the eyes closed. Take a big breath into the belly. Open the mouth, exhale. Two more like this. Take a big breath into the belly. Open the mouth, exhale. Let's do that one more time. Big breath in. Big breath out. Before we end our session together, I just want you to take a moment with your eyes still closed to think about three things that you are grateful for today. And one of them can obviously be your breathing, can be your breath. So it's never the big things that really change our mood, flip our perspective. It's always something small, something that we might even brush off as insignificant, might not even notice, but it means everything. Take a moment to notice three things that you're really, really grateful for today that perhaps you've been taking for granted. edges of your lips lift a little bit let there be a hint of a smile on your face I'll leave you with a little shift in perspective that was brought to me by a friend this morning so we were finishing up our practice and um, we were having a chat in the in the locker room, as you do. And, um, you know, I told her I've come back um, from from being away for a couple of weeks and it feels like everybody's in a couple at the moment. I mean, you know, I've been out there looking for love uh, for the longest time. and I feel like I haven't had any luck. And here I am and I'm meeting everyone that I know and everyone's coupled up and loved up. What is going on? And she said to me, well, Neha, you could look at it like that, or you could look at it as if, well, love is in the air at the moment. There is love all around me. I am surrounded by love, and that is the sign that the universe is sending me. So there's my little shift in perspective for you. So I'm sending, I'm turning around and sending all of that love your way as well 
May you feel it, may you live it, may you breathe it. Continue to smile tons and tons for the rest of the day. Continue to be good to yourself and everybody around you. And um, yeah, just continue to check in with yourself. Your body really has a way of speaking to you. And uh, you just got to tune out the world and just be available to listen. Have a beautiful rest of your day. I love you guys so, so much. Wonderful to spend some time with you. Namaste. Namaste.